Warzone 2.0 available now. Get it while it's hot. Weren't they supposed to change this like back to Warzone? What's up, guys? This is Merc Music, and welcome to Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War two years later. If you guys enjoy this type of stuff and you want to see some more throwback Call of Duty stuff, make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new. I had to re-download Black Ops Cold War on the new PC, and man, they are just slamming Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2 in our faces. Like, get that out of here. Do they really think that we launched Cold War with the intent of wanting to see this? Bah! Putrid. If I'm launching up. Uh, Oh my god, if I'm launching Cold War, that's what I want to play! Anyway, now that I'm calmed down, we are here at the Cold War menu. <laughs> Stupid clown skins, man. I'm not gonna lie though, Cold War's kind of got some bops, we got some good music going right now. I even just appreciate the little sidebar menu for the game modes, like, oh my goodness. Modern Warfare 2 is such a disaster. Hmm, let's see, what, what, what are you gonna fancy today? Let's do some Infected, why not? It's been a minute since I've actually played some Call of Duty. Oh my god, this was my outro. I forgot I used this song for the outro. TBH, honestly, I do prefer the uh, Train Go Boom outro that I've been using. Probably still just gonna use it for this video, but you never know. Like to keep you guys on your toes. You never know what kind of outro I can use. I still very badly wanted to bring back the OG Black Ops 3 outro, but we all know how that went. They say they'll give you a 50-50 revenue split, and then it's more like 1%. <laughs> I know that might not necessarily make a lot of sense to you guys, but imagine showing up to work every day, and instead of getting the 100% amount of money that you're expecting, you get 1% instead. That's what it's like. Sucks at- What was that lobby? What was that? That was our first game of infected we loaded in i heard a squeaker and then it ended and now we're just looking again love the aimlessly walking screen in all these new cod games <laughs> yo let's see what's in the store i'm definitely gonna buy a store bundle today for sure i don't know if these are from the battle pass or not this is weird the white noise assault rifle what is this oh it's like a disco ball no it's got tvs on it my ear balls work don't judge me. <laughs> Yo, this guy's jamming. Why do I not remember this stuff? The Shredder Assault Rifle? Dude, Treyarch's cosmetics are just so insane. They're actually worth it. Oh my god, hello, turn it off. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, yeah. Ah! Uh, uh, Alright, I've got to mute these. I've got to mute them. I've got to do it. Wait, it's going to get me killed. Dude, literally everyone echoing just got me killed. Am I just gonna get spawn trapped? Bro, I haven't played COD in like two weeks. Don't make me leave this. There we go. So there's actually a couple reasons why I'm on Cold War, aside from just the nostalgia factor. I'm not really gonna be sitting over here like, oh, I miss Cold War so much. It's, it's two years old. I don't think anyone's gonna be super overly nostalgic about Cold War. I mean, I know people are still playing it and enjoying it. Probably even more so because the game is currently free for the entire month on PlayStation. Now, I'm not playing on PlayStation. I got it on PC, obviously. But I figured I'd mention that because, hey, if you want to play Black Ops Cold War, it's free. But only if you're on PlayStation. On top of that as well, this game had some really bad security issues and apparently Treyarch fixed them. I don't know why they can't do the same for Black Ops 3, but hey, hopefully nothing fishy happens while we're playing this today. Die! They infected the wrong nerd. No! Oh my god, he had some kind of fart thing. It slowed me down. Oh, we got quadded. Five man, on go! Well, we actually sound like zombies. It's like we're infected or something. No! It's Captain Price just camping. Oh, they bang shot at him. I really hope it shows it. This could be such a nice bang shot kill cam. Oh, let's see. No, come on. It shows the best play of a guy just camping. Ugh. Bro, can we just like bring back OG kill cams for Call of Duty? I'm so tired of playing the game. I don't want to watch some kind of 20 second streak of a guy just camping. At the very least, put something in the settings where we can choose play of the game or kill cam. It might be more difficult to pull off. I don't know the technicalities behind it. But for a lot of these recent COD games, plays have been broken anyway. I mean, look at Vanguard. Almost all of those didn't work. Imagine paying for these like MVP highlight screens just to get this. <laughs> Keep it simple, man. This is Call of Duty after all. Simple wins. Oh, they still have all my favorite game modes. Let's go. I cannot believe I'm about to give Cold War this much credit. But I I actually really like the fact that they kept in a lot of our favorite game modes from like the entire life cycle of playing this game. I weirdly can't say the same for Modern Warfare 2019 and I think even Vanguard as well. Some of them are still there, but not all of them. Yeah, Level 2,500? Bro, go outside. Ain't no way that they are that big of no lives. Let's get this shit together. Let's get this shit. Right, we, go. we got win. I'm on green. He's on green. He took the green. Dude, this feels weird Open to play. Now. This feels weird. Back door, back door, long. Right there. Uh, in the back door. I, I spawned over here by uh, yellow. Watch your back. Watch your back. Dude, oh, I love the comms me. from this team. It's he so came down funny. The stairs. Oh, he's on the stairs. Two of them. Yo, someone's kid is screaming in the background. We got a spy plane. Where they at, blood? Where they at, blood? Don't. No, 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 oh, no. left side, left side. Say yellow, say yellow. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, yellow, yeah, these dudes on our team fucking up, man. They just... 
Just play the game. Who ain't trying to play the fucking domination? Not trying to play. This is hard point, not domination, and you have barely any score. My brother in Christ. I can't even get one for the kill. Yo, that kid, he, he, cheating. he cheating. He cheating. He cheating. They think they're cheating. <laughs> they moving fast as fuck too. Wait, is that actually a thing? I'm standing in the spawn. Man. Fuck. This guy thinks that they're cheating. I mean, they could be. Most of the enemy team's like level 2,500. That shit could be so fake. I don't know. Wait, do we have motion blur on right now? Did it put motion blur on? I swear to God. It so did! Teammate. Ew! I'm out of here. You leave it? All right, back <laughs> He <out>. left. <laughs> <laughs> bro, they could be cheating. They're probably walling or something. We got people cheating in the first actual match I'm playing. Bro, no wonder I didn't hop back on this game. Holy sh! I'm leaving this too. This is terrible. I like playing hardcore in Call of Duty, but at the same time, if people have cheats, it can be really hard to tell if they're actually cheating. You can't watch kill cams, and they could just be walling and shooting you through walls, and you'll have no idea. Oh wait! Oh, we got snipers only. Oh, I'm so down. Oh wait, do I have any classes? Uh oh. I forgot which snipers are actually good in this game. Oh my goodness. I remember not liking the Pellington at all. The M82 was like the worst Barrett ever. The ZRG is powerful, but just way too slow. The Tundra, I remember being really good. I'm not too sure about the Swiss K31. Why is this on a class? Oh my god. I had a Barrett on a class. Wait, does this have any attach? I can't tell if it has any attachments. It doesn't have any. What the f- Okay, we're gonna just- We're just gonna use this one, I guess. Wait, why is the ADS so slow? Holy- His ADS is so fast. Why is this default class so fucking slow? Look at that. Hmm? Mm -hmm. This feels awful. If we're gonna play this, I might have to actually make a class because this feels so terrible. Yeah, no, fuck. Dude! Fuck! What even is this class? I mean, Jesus Christ. We'll make a Swiss K31. Alright, I think we got a good sniping class. I hope it's good. Put me back in, coach. I'm ready. Oh! Uh, ooh! Dude, sniping in Cold War just feels weird to me. There's that initial del. Ugh. That initial aiming delay, I, I can't get used to it. Oh, I want to snipe, but it feels so awful. Why does it feel so bad? Has it just been that long? Like, holy. It's been so long since Eric quick scoped. Oh, we got a no scope. Nice. No kill cam? What the actual? F Yo, I'm not going to lie, though. This game actually looks really good. I, I can give it that. Oh! Line up for a quad. Why are you all over here? There we go. See, how's that hit? How did that hit? I'm so confused. What are you? <laughs> He's quick scoping with the Barrett. Have you lost your mind? Who in their right mind would actually choose to use that weapon? I don't even know how I got that kill. I'm getting out of here. I don't know what it is. I, they have snipers only in this game, but sniping in this game just feels so odd to me. Now, if we had a snipers only mosh pit in Modern Warfare 2, that would be pretty dank. Even though I don't play the game all that much anymore, I could still probably get on there and actually snipe. But this? Okay, so this is Scope's build of the Tundra. I mean, this is from like a year ago. I don't know if this is still what he'd be using, but I hope it's good. It's so weird. Like, I don't really vibe with Black Ops 4 or Cold War, but I am looking forward to whatever they're going to release because they're actually going to care. They're going to try. Even if it ends up being a game that I don't really vibe with all that much. Also, I think a lot of it has to do with the fact that I'm trying to snipe and I have not played a lot of COD recently. What the f I just- What the fuck is happening? I don't even know! Give me a gun I can actually shoot. Yeah, let's just do this free sweeper glitch. Can we still do this? Wow, you can still do the exploit. Two years later, you can still boom, 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 boom. I remember Face Off 6v6 being one of the turning points for multiplayer. Like, when they dropped this, I was actually playing so much more. Oh, we got Glubico! Oh, this map's great. I remember loving this map. Let's go. Oh! I'm spawn trapping! <laughs> no! I had a streak going, dude! If I get shotgun one more fucking time by the granite gobbler, I swear. It's coming out. Ah, this is the Cold War I remember playing. <laughs> what in the martyrdom was that? Oh, you're supposed to put a Simtex on so we can blow up after. You know, I think they made it a little bit worse to do. Like, I'm mostly getting Martyrdome kills from the Simtex. Did they nerf the Street Sweeper, though? It doesn't feel as strong as it was before. Ah! Nice death noise. This game very good. Oh, I, I blew myself up. I didn't mean to do that. It's actually just so weird that they will leave their games in a broken state and not fix them because it appeals to the casuals, the plebs like me. Like, if I'm not doing well on Cold War, this is the way I'm going to play because I suck at And instead of trying to get good, I would rather just use some dumb, goofy class that's broken. I was actually the best on the team, though. <laughs>
a Dragonite. Ah, there's a Dragonite! Dude, I cannot handle this Pokemon Go event. I see a Dragonite on the nearby, but I gotta finish recording this video. I love Cold War so much! <laughs> Why do we have such basic, terrible default classes? Like, what? <laughs> we got a split quad. I got a split quad with an AK-74U in hardcore. I am so good. I don't think it's actually ever been done before. <laughs> There's a guy actually just using an RPG the whole time. <laughs> I don't like this anymore. We're gonna try to hit with the AK-47 now. Pancake. <laughs> Enough with the flashbangs! Where did you come from? Zooted? Oh, wait, no, that's Zooted. <laughs> He's Zooted. Zuda, Chris. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so Cold War two years later, I think I'm basically in the same mindset that I was when this game was in its prime. I don't really know if I like playing a lot of the typical multiplayer stuff, but Hardcore 6v6 face-off is my jam. Oh, I like this game mode quite a lot. Granted, you know, some lobbies can be kind of iffy, they can be not so fun, but it feels like the overall typical Hardcore face-off experience is just, you know, chaotic, fast-paced fun. I like that. To me, that's Call of Duty. Hey, we actually won a game! Wow! The best play was your boy. Oh my god. <laughs> But I get to respawn, and I think this is when I got the split quad, right? You just gotta wait for me to... Oh, there it is. Yes. Oh, the drag. That miracle last kill. To be perfectly honest, I thought the AK-47 quad was a lot better than the 74U quad, but... Is this Dragonite still gonna be here? We gotta get the Dragonite. We gotta do it. Ah, it's not shiny. Not shiny. We got him. All right, I am back, and we got the Dragonite. It is unfortunately not shiny, but because of this event, it's brought my total up to eight, and seven of them have been caught just from this event, which is freaking dope! But with that being said, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me play Black Ops Cold War two years later. The game is currently free on PlayStation, but as far as it goes for whether or not you'll find hackers on here, I think you might still find them, at least on PC. But either way, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did it and you want to see some more throwback Call of Duty stuff, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later. Now come, <laughs>